Welcome to my introduction to how to use a sewing machine. I'm just going to go over some of the basics. Every sewing machine is different, but you've got the same things on each one in different orders. I've got the tension here, the stitch type here. I've got it set to a plain straight line stitch. So you've got the bit here telling you your different stitch types and you get your stitch length here. <laughs> Great <ball. laughs> Should we keep it in for comic effect? <laughs> okay. Every sewing machine has thread at the top and one at the bottom. The one in the bottom you have in a little bobbin that come in metal or plastic. So to do the, this bottom one it comes empty so you've got to take your thread from the top. I've got to undo this. The sewing machines come with a little wheel at the side. Mine you just pull it out and that stops when you press the foot. The needle doesn't work anymore. So you just wind that round your little tension thing, thread it through the bobbin, mm. leave a bit of length and put it on. And go over and just press. When it's finished, it'll stop automatically. Okay, when you're finished doing that, you just simply push your wheel back in and that'll mean your needle will work again. Okay, threading the machine, there'll be a little hook there go through there, down, up, but keep it slightly on the right hand side, there's a wee bit in here, you can move it with the wheel, so that'll go up and down, so you can move that up, round to the left, down, there's a little hook there, it might be different on your machine, but, and then through the needle, my thread still through from before, okay, and you can get a little thing that helps you go through the needle. I don't know what it's called. Okay, so I've done that. Next comes doing the bobbin. Okay. Some machine machines you'll have a wee bit on the top and you just slide it out and you just place the bobbin in. This one you've got to take that out. Okay, you can take that out. Get your bobbin. Place it so the thread's coming on that direction. Going that way. Place it in. Okay, so place it in, slide it through, so it's coming out there. Place it in, click, and let that drop down. And put that back on again. Okay, using the wheel at the side, you can go down, come back up. I think it seems to take twice to do this. Get something sharp.
we have them both of them sitting through there coming out on the left and we'll leave a bit of length and that's you ready to sew.